It's the model FTR120 Fat Boy Shorty. This in here doesn't have the charcoal grill in between. It's two cooking chambers separately. Two independent fire boxes to fire each side. 3,500 pound axles. 15 inch wheels and tires. It's got insulated fire boxes. And both boxes have two LP burners installed in them. Right side has an extra rack in it. It has three racks. Left chamber has uh, two racks. These are reverse flow. If you look in the bottom, you see there's a steel plate down there, which us in the barbecue world call a baffle. And what you're doing is you're forcing the heat out of your firebox into the bottom of your chamber underneath that baffle. And then it comes up, and you're reversing the flow back down the chamber and up out of the stack. So if you see a stack and a firebox on the same side, and it has a baffle in it, most likely it's reverse flow. If not, the heat's going to shoot straight from there to there. Just like if you put that stack on this side, then your heat's going to come straight from that box, the shortest possible way it can get out that stack. And that reverse flow is good because that baffle also gets hot and radiates heat. And you're getting everything even in there with your heat. Same thing, firebox, stack. Is down, comes up over the racks, back out the stacks. Two inch square tube frame, extended tongue. We put two uh, burner stands on the rear back here for the customer. Keep them chilly warm. Barbecue sauce, beans, full peanuts, fish fry. It's quarter inch rolled steel. And of course, this one here is five foot, little over five foot length each chamber and 40 inches in diameter. It's about 25 square foot of cooking space with two shelves in it. As you can see, that's where the heat enters. And then you got your baffle up in there that it forces the heat all the way to the end and then up and over and back down this way. The burner there, burner there. The way we operate this, we just take a iron skillet, set it right there over top of that burner. Put you some wood in it. And that's where you get your smoke from.
raise the hinges on it. That's your typical dowel rod and round tubing. Front firebox. Also it has two burners in it. Had this one here fired up yesterday. Had the rear box. Took about 12 minutes. It got up to 200 degrees with one burner going. And the burner was only turned up one turn. You get these things up to temperature. My favorite is 225. Walk away from it. As long as you keep you some wood in there over top of that burner. And an iron skillet of some type. You got your smoke and heat. Let the smoker do the rest. If you're interested in one of these, give me an email, mlj963 at gmail.com. I'll have you one of these built. Thank you. Have a great day for watching.